hi everybody it's Denny here from Angel Handmade Papercraft today I am merging a few different products together so I am using a stamp set from Stamping Bella called Oddball Gamer he's from the Oddball collection and then I will be bringing in some stamp sets from My Favourite Things called Level Up and also the My Favourite Things game controller so I started out I have stamped out the image using some memento tuxedo black um, I did fussy cut the top of the stamp uh, to make sure that he didn't get cut off when I ran him through my big shot and this is the my favorite things stamp set that I'm bringing in and the game controller so I've just run the game controller through my big shot just using some black American crafts cardstock I'm bringing in a white gel pen to add some details to the controller some nuvo crystal drops in the ebony black and as you can see I did ask my son to bring out his controller for me um, so I could make sure that I could add all of those extra little details in so I'm being very very careful not to touch that game controller um, it is obviously still wet will need to be left overnight so that everything can be dried now I'm going in and coloring my image up using Copic markers um, the recipient that uh, sorry the purchaser of the card which is a friend of mine uh, specifically asked for certain colors and things to be on this card so I'm making sure that I'm getting every single detail that she has requested onto the card and making sure that it is nice and personalized with the right color hair etc so I did have the stamp set uh, I stamped him on some express at blending card I'm not sure if I mentioned that I'm just stamping out uh, one of the sentiments from the uh, Ba, 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 the level up stamp set and I've used some silver embossing powder from Ranger and some ink on three embossing ink I did prep the area first with an embossing pad to make sure that everything stuck where it should be and not anywhere else I couldn't find any papers to match the stamp set today so I decided to make my own so I am just doing some repetitive stamping using the sentiments moving them around and then re-stamping them so I am using my misty stamping tool for that so that I can get them all exactly where I want them to be just using some memento tuxedo black and some more of the express at blending card I've just trimmed everything down I'm adding a matte black layer behind and I'm just using some stars that I had cut out previously um, and then adding some extras that I needed adhering everything down Just being really, really careful here because I don't want to knock anything. This was a pretty quick card actually, considering that I had to make my own paper and everything. Um, so it is just about done. I'm just adding some adhesive to the back. I knocked my Helmer adhesive, which is my usual go-to. I must have knocked it on the floor and it rolled under my desk. So I couldn't find it when I was making this card. So I had to pull out my old Tombow Mono Multi, which is almost empty by the look of it. So I'm just squeezing out the last little bits that I can out of that adhesive. And then I'm gonna pop it down on a Kucha Creations card base. And that's my card done so I didn't um, grab the end of the card making on video because I did have to leave it overnight very carefully um, I hope you have enjoyed this video and I hope to see you all soon bye